waiting for something. I don't believe you had the pleasure of meeting my friend. Oh no! The dragon!
Now let's see who Zen Tuo really is. It's Maggie Z. It was her disappearing act that gave her away. Quite a trick, until I realized she was conveniently near a sewer entrance. Using the dragon as a distraction, she could drop down into the sewer and be gone. <laughs> <laughs> nice try, Mystery Inc. Like she's not real, she's mother. You can't catch what you can't hold. That sounded like a man's voice. I know what you're all thinking. That voice. I know Jed, and and that wasn't him. <laughs> I wrote a little something just for you. Let's see if you can survive it. But if you can't, ah! prove anything. Besides, I'm the victim here. What do you mean? Daphne, what we have before us is a story of jealousy. Mr. Wiener's band, Deaf Potato, was never a real success. He blamed his failure on the guitar ghoul, whom he saw as a rival. Wait, so like, you blamed yourself? Not quite. He was offered a way to destroy the guitar ghoul, literally from the inside. All he needed was this costume. Scooby? Mummer. Of course. 
Who gave you that costume, Mr. Wiener? They didn't offer their name. Just a chance for revenge. By sabotaging the Guitar Ghoul's popular theme park. And I would have gotten away with it, too, if it hadn't been for you meddling kids. So, who's the real ghoul? And why is he hiding? Not he. She! Yeah, Velma's right. I am the real Guitar Ghoul. But why the secret identity? I wanted to share my music, not my life. So I created the Guitar Ghoul disguise. Perhaps this uh, could remain our little secret, huh? Like our lips are sealed. Thanks, I appreciate it. In exchange, I've got some information which you might find interesting.
Somewhere. The jig is up, Mr. Stanton. Is it? Like, there are two of you! Hmm. Scooby? It seems Marcy was trying to frame Stanton, not Jed. Marcy? But why? Because I helped create Mubber, but you took all the credit for it. I thought that if I gave you a bad name, I could start up my own business. Mr. Stanton, is this true? Marcy, I didn't know you felt this way. You should have talked to me about it. Destroying the reputation of monstrous fright and magic would destroy Mubber. I'm sorry if I hurt you, Marcy. I'd like you to become a partner in the company. If you can forgive me, that is. Yeah, I think I can do that. Another mystery solved. Are you coming, Shaggy? Just making myself something for the road. I call it a mother witch. <laughs> huh? What gives? <laughs> now that's what I call a light snack. <laughs> <laughs>